Hi. During the next few minutes, I'll introduce to you Design Control, the easy to use template design tool for rich media stories. Our template will contain all settings and design elements that are required to create rich media presentations with Eye Control or Live Control, the two other products in Intermedia Solutions' Rich Media Collection. The best way to learn any product is by using it. Feel free to click on this link and download a free demo version. Once you've started Design Control, the first thing you have to do is create a new master template from the file menu in the menu bar. To begin, define a destination with streaming format and name it in the desktop properties. By double clicking on your destination, you'll be able to define additional technical settings such as server location and data rate. Check the manual for further details. Once all technical details have been set, we'll now proceed to create the layout of the template. Please click on the Layout tab. By default, Design Control will suggest a basic layout which you can modify as you like. Start with a mouse click on the blue field and select the Template Properties option. This will allow you to modify size, background color, and background image. The basic requirements for every template are frames for video, logos, headlines, table of contents, and graphics. You'll find two buttons on the icon bar, one with a camera and one with a frame symbol. Click on the camera icon and draw a frame for your video signal on your template. A right mouse click leads you to properties such as name of the frame, video size, player buttons, etc. etc. We've added some functionality for additional comfort, such as resize automatically, which will take away the hassles of having to figure out the proper size of the player window later. Next, we need some frames for all other media assets that we want to add to our story later. Please use the frame icon to draw additional frames as needed. Now, with a right mouse click, every new area can be further configured through its properties menu. You'll see that you can assign each frame to texts, graphics, library objects, or TOC or any combination of the above. Library objects are especially powerful. Eye control and live control can handle this just like any other media type. If your template includes a frame for library objects, you'll be able to include flash animations, eShops, or entire web pages in your stories. Design control even allows you to include these library objects with your template and export them for later use with eye control or live control. You can see for yourself a few mouse clicks and you're done. Now here's a tip. Make sure that none of the frames overlap with each other or the border of the template. The following animation has been created with Flash with just a few steps. We'll save it as a library object, including all additional files. Select Web Library Object as an object type. Switch to the Properties menu by pressing Create. Now, collect all required files under Web Library Object Options. Import all HTML files to the left column using the Add button. To define the start file, select a file and press Set as Main. Next, import all other files of your animation to the right column with Add. Now you've collected all necessary elements of a new web library object. You'll be able to add this object like any other file to your timeline. Finally, you only need to save the template as a template collection in the file menu. Your template can now be used in Eye Control or Live Control and will include all library objects as well. Additional information can be found in our Design Control Manual. For further questions, please don't hesitate to contact us at our website. Rich Media Publishing has never been so easy.